happy Monday! It is glutes day. We're gonna do glutes today and it's gonna be a lot. But I don't have a lot of time to actually do my workout today. I'm trying to get it done. So I'm just trying to warm up my joints, warm up my back because we need to do that regardless of whether or not you have time you gotta warm up better skip some sets than go into your workout not warming up okay you don't want to do that hoping i can get a smith machine i see that one is available it's gonna be a good week full of good workouts i absolutely hate working out in the morning i do not like it like early this is actually too early for me it's like 9 something, 9.30. I'm not in the vibe. I am ashy today. Ooh. Cat, cows, scapular, retracts. All right. Let's do this, y'all. I want you to take a look at the fit today. Cause it's isn't it so cute it's such a vibe we're ready to start hip thrusting am i ready absolutely 10 to 12. boss texting me like boy all right we're gonna do again 10 to 12 we got 45 and 25 Maluma is that boy Maluma it was in his pretty boy era and he's still amazing I freaking love Maluma so much <laughs> Ooh, it's heavy. Oh my God. I felt every second of that. I'm still recovering from that set. That was a lot, that was a lot, that was a lot, that was a lot. I was only able to get to 10, so. I'm probably gonna throw in the fives on each side and see if we can do eight. If we can get to eight, I'm solid with that. And then push one last set. Um, take off the fives and see if we can get to 12. A couple seconds left to press and let's do it again, okay? I don't know if I'm the only one who gets a little anxiety when you're about to lift something that is a little heavy, you know? Five, come on. Six. Seven, come on. I can do one more. I could barely lift it. I was scared. Now that I know I could get nine with this weight. We're gonna rest for two minutes or as long as I need and we're gonna drop the fives and see if we can get to 12. So, yeah, we're ready. Last set, best set, come on. Easy, easy work. It's enough for today. We're about to do my least favorite workout, which is 
Bulgarians. I don't like Bulgarian split squats. They're not my favorite thing, but we're gonna get them done anyways. So we're gonna do three sets. <laughs> this actually feels light, so let's hope it stays that way, you know? All right, let's get it, y'all. I'm gonna do eight, just to warm up, you know? to do 10. Totally fine. No big deal. You know? Halfway there, come on. Goal is to do 8 to 10. And that's how you progress. So... We're gonna see how many we get. Don't compromise your form for going heavier on weight. That's like the biggest advice I can give you. If your form is trash and you're just trying to push more weight because that's what you think is gonna get your results, you're gonna get injured and getting injured will just mean you're gonna be out of the gym, not making progress. So take your mind to progress, okay? I'm really struggling with these. I usually do them on the Smith, but both machines, both the Smith machines were taken. And it's a little bit free in case anybody else wanted to use it. The gym is kind of packed. So in case anybody was eyeing the Smith, I was like, I can totally do this with dumbbells. You know, the virus will do the other leg and I'll come back with a heavier dumbbell. <sighs> I'm feeling everything so much today. What? I don't know why. But these will do these. We're gonna do less reps. So name it again. Higher, higher weight, fewer reps. Easy work. Come on. Oh, here we go. They feel so heavy today. They feel so heavy. I got one more. I usually do the 45s. I'm feeling super fatigued today. I think it's because I'm working out earlier. I don't really know, so I'm gonna stick with the 40s and try to push through. Bad Bunny just doesn't hit the same anymore. I kind of miss Bad Bunny. I'm trying to recover, girl. Dang, these sets are a lot today but i'm having a good workout so ah we're pushing through girl my legs are shaking what that song was underrated okay let's get it y'all all right girl i've been over here dreading this last set of these we gotta finish this we just gotta do it Sometimes it's not gonna be like flowers and everything. It's gonna be a tough workout and that's what it, it's meant to challenge you. So, I cooled down too long. I don't wanna do it no more. I don't wanna do it no more. All right, here we go, girl. <sighs> it's on fire. All right, let's go do some kickbacks. Cable kickbacks. We're only gonna do three sets. I'm gonna start relatively late. And I uh, hope we can get through this, okay? Cause I, Ooh, Ooh girl. All right. So you're gonna kick back at an angle, okay? Not straight ahead. All right, you got this.
fix it. We did that. I'll see you at home. We are back home. I'm back home. I did 30 minutes of cardio on my stepper. Never mind, I look crazy right now. I need to wash my hair. But I did 30 minutes of cardio on my stepper and then <laughs> what? I didn't know you were filming that this way. So I came in like this <laughs> and then I just <laughs> one walk. You can do it, Charlie. He could. He could. I uh let's review the workout so let's recap the workout so I got to the gym I did five minutes on the treadmill I usually do that to kind of like warm up because I'm usually like chilling before I go to the gym so um I walked in there walked for five minutes and then I went and did and did my mobility work so mobility workouts are so important they're gonna help you move better and overall just lift better and it's important to always warm up before you start lifting weights so did that a couple of minutes and then i went into smith machine hip thrust did bulgarian split squats and those test me every time i kind of want to replace those and not the bulgarians anymore i kind of want to start doing step ups instead I just feel like it's gonna be a little bit better. I don't enjoy Bulgarian split squats. I never have. Um, and people say like, the workout that you struggle with the most is the one I, no, it's just that that one just tests my will to live every single time. And I just don't feel like being tested like that sometimes. So I think I will replace them. <laughs> I'll keep you updated. Then I went into uh, RDLs, glute focus, so with a bend at the knee. I did three sets of uh, kickbacks, of the glute medius kickbacks. But we got in and out in about an hour and a half. My workouts usually last about two hours when I go to the gym, just because I do take my time between sets and I am trying to grow in strength more than anything. Um, there are times when your workouts will be a little bit quicker if you're not trying to push yourself to your max with weight. Um, that's totally fine, but whenever you're trying to push yourself in strength, I would definitely say make sure you have the time to recover in between sets because you don't want to do yourself at the service and going to your next set still tired from the previous one and half ass it. So, in the meantime, anywho. Came back, the 30 minutes of cardio on the stepper, went live to do that, that was very fun. So I've been getting a lot of questions about my cardio routine lately. I try to stay with cardio at a heart rate between 140 to 160 at max. Um, but my sustainable heart rate throughout my cardio workout, it's between 140 to 150, 155, 160 the max. And I try to keep that heart rate throughout my entire cardio session and my cardio sessions are 30 minutes long. So what this kind of guarantees me is that I'm not like pushing myself to the max when it comes to exhausting myself because I want to be able to recover for my next session. And this is something that I've talked about is recovery recently. Um, and I think that lowering the level of stress that I put on my body has really helped with uh, how my body reacts i feel like i was stressing my body so so much by pushing it to the max like every single time at least with cardio and my body was just being under a lot of stress and it wasn't reacting well to it um and now i'm just focused on you know recovery i could have done this workout <laughs> i could have done this workout at home especially because um I have everything that I need. You know, if you have dumbbells, you can do this workout at home. Um, you know, you can do a dumbbell glute bridge, um, a dumbbell hip thrust. You can do these at home. You can do Bulgarians with the dumbbells, um, RDLs with the dumbbells, and the cable kickbacks. You can do those. You can just do them with a resistance band. Uh, there are ways that you can get your workouts in at home. You go to the gym so that you can have access to bigger weights. Um, so if you are somebody who works out at home, this is a glute workout that you can do or workouts and push yourself with, uh, if you don't have access to higher weights, bigger weights, 
then push yourself with more reps you know and that's how we can get our workout in at home i absolutely love you thank you so much for hanging out with me today i will see you back for the next one let me know whatever workouts you want to see any machines that you want to see me try let me know down below i absolutely love you we love you right charlie we absolutely love you can i get a cuddle could i please